This is the lockpicking lawyer, and sometimes I come across a lock that is impressively bad. This pin lock for Mighty Mule gate openers is one of those products. It was sent to me by Bradley in Fremont, California, who apparently installs gates and openers with some frequency. This lock replaces the clevis pin that links the gate to the opening arm. That looks something like this. By locking that joint, it ensures the gate can't be opened simply by pulling out the clevis pin, and conversely, a key holder can open the gate in case of a jam or power failure. Now, at first glance, this appears to have an unremarkable laminated steel construction, but upon closer examination, we can look down the keyhole and see that the housing is made out of gray plastic. You can see I deform that by pushing on it with my pick. That's what I expect to see on a $1 lock, not an $18 lock for a $400 mechanism securing a $1,000 plus gate. This lock is almost certainly going to break pretty quickly in normal use and should be pickable by a novice. Let's give it a try. I'm going to use this 40 thousandths thick turner in the bottom of the keyway and a wave rake. These are both part of the Genesis set that I sell over on covertinstruments.com. And right away, I can feel almost a mushy feeling from that plastic housing. It's a really strange bit of feedback. But let's see how it affects picking. You can see after just a little bit of jiggling, we got that open. Let's do that one more time so you can see it was not a fluke. And once again, it opened very quickly. Okay, folks, obviously both the quality and security of this product are a big disappointment and frankly, an embarrassment to Mighty Mule. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.